Hello, this is Steve at Hydrogen for Health. Today I want to show you our new H2 Life Browns gas machine. This is a brand new machine for us. We've uh, upgraded it substantially and I want to tell you about it today. As you can see, this new machine only has one bubbler. Our old machine had two bubblers and let me tell you why this one only has one bubbler. Inside of this machine is a new generator that's much more efficient that uses much less slide than the other generator. It's a dry cell generator. The other generator we're using was a wet cell. It was using 15 grams of lye to make the reaction work. This machine uses an incredible two grams of lye, barely any lye. That is a half a teaspoon of lye. Therefore, we only need one scrubbing bubbler here to scrub out any lye that might escape with the Brown's gas. The generator in it is much more reliable. It doesn't degrade like the wet cell did. Therefore, it'll last much, much longer. As you can see, the design is more compact. This measures 13 inches tall by 10 and a half inches wide. And it's very easy to carry with one hand. It has a carrying handle here. Our other machine, you had to carry it with two hands. And it also weighs less. You can see here our timer has changed. This timer can be set anywhere from one minute to 999 hours. And it's very easy to set. You can see here we've got our on off switch. Here's our gas output port right down here on the bottom. This is how you drain the water out. So you don't need to take this machine and dump it upside down to drain the water out. It'll drain out right from that port there. This pulls out and there's a tube that pulls out and you can drain it out into the sink. As you can see here, we've got a lamp that indicates when you need to fill the reservoir, that'll turn red. And then we have a lamp here that indicates when the reservoir is full and that green lamp will come on there. The water fills from the top in this port here and our bubbler water fills from this port here and it's easily drained out from this port here. This machine will generate anywhere between 300 and 450 milliliters per minute. On the side, you can see we have our flash port which, and also this is a pressure release valve. So this releases pressure over 2 PSI. The flash port is there for obvious reasons. If you were to be using a cannula and somehow you got a hold of some static electricity, that static electricity will light the gas mixture and it'll travel down the tube until it hits this bubbler and right here on this port, the flash will come out this port right here. Without this, the bubbler would explode. Very, very important safety feature that a lot of the other machines on the market don't have. Okay, now let me show you how easy it is to use. You simply fill up your main reservoir tank until your reservoir full light comes on. You fill up your bubbler up to about this line here. Then you can go ahead and just turn the machine on. You'll hear the fans start to go. And you dial in how many minutes you want to breathe here. And you just go ahead and press this button. You'll see that the red light comes on and it's generating Brown's gas. For those of you that don't know, Brown's gas is 66% hydrogen and 33% oxygen. That's Brown's gas. For breathing with a cannula, just take the end, press it onto the port there, and you're ready to breathe. You can see the gas coming out there. If you want to make hydrogen water, very easy to do. Our machine comes with a stainless steel 0.5 micron diffusion stones. So you're going to get really small bubbles with this. You simply plug that in and drop this into your water. And within minutes, you'll have hydrogen water. You can find this safe Brown's gas machine on our website, www.hydrogen4health.com.
This is Steve. Thanks for watching.